UNC Kentucky, this game was just simply insane. Back and forth, left and right, going at it. Joe Barry gets her out of the game. Stillman White comes in, draws two fouls on De'Aaron Fox. He goes out the game, back and forth, left and right. Luke May showing out, 17 points. Kennedy Meeks has his 17 rebounds. Um, wow, what a game. Uh, let's get into it. Um, North Carolina up 38-33 at the half. Um, they battle in the second half. Kentucky gets the lead. They're up 64 to 59. My UNC Tar Heels, they come up, score six unanswered. You have a, uh, a uh, dish down low, splits two defenders. Hicks gets, gets it, puts it up, down by three. Justin Jackson comes down after a second stop, gets a nice bounce. Then we come down a third time. Joel Berry, floater off the backboard in. Then we stop him again, eight unanswered, actually. Meeks gets a tip in, we're up, and uh, wow. Um, we develop a lead, you go down the stretch. Um, we're up, well, like less than a minute to go, and Malik Monk decides to show his 47 point in November self, and he trains two threes. Uh, we turn the ball over once, all of a sudden it's tied, 73-73, 7.4 seconds left. And what happens? Uh, Kennedy Meeks, I believe, was the inbounder. Tosses it in to Pinson. Chogs up court. Kentucky's trying to stay with him. Chogs up court. Luke May following him. Uh, Pinson comes across right in front of the three on the corner. He hands it to Luke May. Luke May takes the ball. Has a simple over-the-shoulder shot. Sinks it. 0.3 left. UNC wins 75-73. Just an insane game. An insane classic. And uh, wow. It was unreal. Luke May, 17 points. Uh, Joel Berry, 11. Uh, still at 33 minutes, though he hurt himself early in the game, resulting in Stillman White coming in. He had two points, two rebounds. Now Meeks, seven points, 12 defensive rebounds, 17 total, uh, four blocks. Isaiah Hicks follows that, only four points, but three blocks. Somehow did not have a single rebound to what I'm – I'm looking at the box score right now. We didn't have a single rebound. I have no idea how that happened. But we win, and I don't even think we played our best, which was, which was insane. But they said, uh, Kentucky's playing. Humphreys is going insane. He's dropping buckets. <clears throat> and they said, Kentucky is undefeated this year with Humphreys when he scores. Well, guess what? That ends. Kentucky season's over. They're SEC regular season champs, SEC tournament champs. 32-6, and six. you got to give it up to them. They had a great season. The Aaron Fox and Malik Monk are both going to be like top seven picks. They're both going to be stars in the league. Bam Adebayo, hell of a player. But we move on. UNC, they have the size. They have the guards. They have the takeover player. They have the shooting. They play good defense. They have a deep bench. It's just going to be fun. Um, they have Oregon in the final four. Oregon's the three seed. They're facing them. Winner of that. In Arizona, uh, goes to the final. They'll get Gonzaga or South Carolina. And let me tell you, if we somehow managed an all Carolina final, that'd be insane. Now I'm not chinksing anything, but wow, this could be this could be fun. This is a weird Final Four. You got South Carolina, Gonzaga, then Oregon, UNC. Three of those four teams they are are really not familiar with Final Fours, but um. We're going to Arizona next weekend, and it's getting fun, guys. We had uh, some crazy stuff happen this weekend. Uh, Chioza hit the buzzer beater. You have Luke May hit his game winner. You had South Carolina doing their thing. Um, Oregon upsets Kansas. It's just been a ride, and you cap it off with this insane game. Luke May drills the game winner. Um, simply been insane, but... All has been done, and we're going to wait for the Final Four next weekend, and we're going to hope for some good matchups. I definitely think we will get some. Gonzaga plays South Carolina at 6.09 um, on uh, Saturday, and then you get uh, UNC Oregon 8.49 p.m. also on CBS, so they'll battle it out. So until next weekend, guys, I mean, we're going to get some fun matchups. We really are. So, but again, until uh, next weekend, 
see you guys later. Um, it's been fun. Have a nice day, guys.